The lead detective in the Kyle Rittenhouse double homicide case, Martin Howard, took the stand Wednesday. He was on duty August 25th when Rittenhouse opened fire with his AR-15. At that time, uh, we initially were, got a report that there were four homicide victims. Two died that night. Joseph Rosenbaum and Anthony Huber. Gage Grosskreutz was shot but survived. Prosecutors say Rittenhouse first took aim at Rosenbaum, while many were live streaming. Videos that are now critical in the case. Jurors shown never before seen footage from the deadly shooting of Joseph Rosenbaum. In the video, you see Rittenhouse running and a shot rings out. Oh, they shoot. Oh. That the four shots that were just heard are the four shots that the defendant, Kyle Rittenhouse, fired at Joseph Rosenbaum. Then video from another angle of the Rosenbaum shooting. That the individual who is I'm pointing to right now who is running is the defendant Kyle Rittenhouse. And this individual here is Joseph Rosenbaum. Yeah. Ooh, he shot him. In the video, it appears Rittenhouse makes a phone call and takes off while others go to Rosenbaum's aid, carrying him to a car. Minutes later, Rittenhouse is seen running down Sheridan Road where he falls and fires again, killing Huber and Grosskreutz in the shoulder. Jurors watched closely. At times, Rittenhouse looked away. How many uh, times did the defendant fire his gun? Eight times. Hillary joining us once again. Rittenhouse claims he shot the men in self-defense. Right, Toya, his attorneys say he only fired at people he thought would hurt him or worse.